Point Sur Lighthouse is celebrating its 128th birthday with Living History Day out on the rock, as it's known. Hax News reporter Caitlin Conrad has our story from Big Sur. And the government decided to make her the first lighthouse keeper on the whole of the West Coast. And come get a cup and full, full of shells are actually laid down however you want to do it. Every August 1st, Point Sur Lighthouse is transported back in time. Hey ho, and up she rises early in the morning. As volunteers and state park staff celebrate the anniversary of the first lighting in 1889. And I think it's a treat for the visitors and, and it's a treat for our volunteers. You know, this is what we work hard for every year. It took four keepers and their families to operate the lighthouse and keep the ships out at sea safely away from the rugged Big Sur cliffs. The light was put here in 1889 because it's a point that's out in the water Ships at the time had to make a course change as they went by Point Sur, so this was a good marker for them to know when to make the, the change. I guess what the, the spring is doing is trying to open the vice. On Living History Day, the light keepers and their families and friends are brought back to life. I am known as the socialite lighthouse keeper, and I love baking pies. Giving visitors a better understanding of how things were done on the rock. Kids like us, we have technology these days, and they didn't have technology back then. And, um, you know, you had to walk down and up the hill to go to school and all this stuff. So it's really cool for us to learn about it. The period costumes and displays helping them to imagine what life might have been like out on Point Sur. I guess it would be pretty cool, but definitely hard at times because, like, manning the lighthouse, all that stuff. About 90 people donate their time year-round to maintain the light station and keep it open to visitors. I found it was one of the most congenial group of people that I've ever had a chance to work with and just couldn't help but stay here and be part of it. Reporting from Point Sur, Caitlin Conrad, KSBW, Action News 8.